guys it's your girl craze and welcome or welcome back to my channel today i'm back with another video and i'm going to be taking you through my masters like today i start my masters part of my program so i'm gonna vlog the first couple of days and i have a lot of studying to do i have a lot of coursework well i have a deadline this friday to submit my coursework and the plan by the end of today is have that finished or either submit it today which is wednesday or tomorrow which is thursday but i just need to get it done and i've also got a lot of studying to do for some modules that i have like classes prep all those fun things so i'm so excited to take you along with me and i hope you guys enjoy this vlog plan for today the time is 7 44 i have a class this morning at 9 a.m which means i really need to get going so the next boss i need to get is in 12 minutes so we're gonna go go now So I am now in the library and I am time is my last class just finished and it was really good. I really enjoyed it and like the people there the people there are really now now I'm in the library with Yauda. She's to my left I found her Yauda's <laughs> but um for now I'm gonna do some work for the next hour and then go to my final class. Yeah my day will finish way later but the library's quite empty but I'll show you what it looks like because <laughs> really do like working with people whether what happens if i lose my way with the compass and a map i made looking for my shadow in the dark what happens if i look for you with the compass and my tennis shoes and find you it's holding someone else's heart Sure. You told me I'm pretty. 
rejected And I don't move with much direction anymore I don't know what I'm looking for I can't believe I care Soon I want a pinky swear I'm leaving, I'll call you when I'm there What happens if I lose my way With a compass and a map I made Looking for my shadow in the dark What happens if I lose We're on our way now to you, Lord. I'm following your lead actually. We're going back to, no, we're not done studying, so we're gonna go to New Law. So that's Samira's place, not mine, to study. But I think it will be good because we've still got a lot of work to get done and I really need to just get this. So Samira and I are now at Uni U Law, University of Law. I don't go here, Samira does. And we're working here a bit for some more time, but we just went and stopped off at Tesco beforehand to get some snacks to push us through like the final bits of working. I bought a cheeky Red Bull. This is a flavor I haven't tried before. I don't recommend Red Bull. I don't condone people drinking it. And I say as I do. No, I do. No, I don't do as I say. No. Yeah, I don't take my own advice, basically. Um, and then I got this. Really good. I had them when I was studying with Ogo on campus. And oh, sensational. Since then, I've been hooked. And last but not least, this. This grenade bar. This has got high protein, low sugar. It's really good if you're like trying to get your protein intake up. But I'm not actually going to have this today because I forgot I had it. <laughs> Okay. Um, it was really good. Yeah. It's a cheddar and red onion. Mm -hmm. Crisps. Delish. Delish. As you can tell, I really like them. Delish. Was the sushi um, good? No, it wasn't. It was really bad. Okay. The rice was really dry. I would not recommend this okay. go Meal deal situation. You know, you know how it gets. Uni so students so broke. <laughs> But yeah, basically we both got some stuff and I'm gonna have mine now and get started on work. But before I do that, I think I wanna try out, I, no, not gonna condone it, not gonna recommend. <laughs> but if you ever do, yeah, the um, tr best flavor is tropical. Also, if you're, this is sugar free. I'd give it a seven out of 10. I'd give my tropical red ball 10 out of 10. This tastes like squash, like fruit juice. So it's good, but it's not my other one, but they didn't have that. Okay, I'm gonna get to work now. And by the end of today, I need to have my other thing done. If I don't, no, I have to, I have to. Okay, I'm gonna do it. ladies hey beautiful people time is and boy am i tired look look 
I'm on five, seven, four, nine words. That's, now the point is that I cut it down from 7,200 to five, seven, four, nine, and I still need to get rid of another 1,200, which is a lot, but doable. And I think I just need to be really stringent but i'm gonna go home and finish this off i have a 9 a.m tomorrow morning and i think i'm actually not going to vlog the next couple of days i'm so tired like genuinely i feel like there's a lot i've filmed today this is still the current setup samira's gone to the toilet but i think we're gonna go and have some dinner so i think we're gonna go for pho the time like i said is 8 50 there's one that closes at 10 but i think we can go there it's literally called pho but I literally love butter. And yeah, okay. Honestly, all I had to do was the coursework today. Like, I did work this morning at 5 a.m. I did work in between my classes. I did work in my classes. It's been a heavy work day, but I think once this coursework is done, I'll feel like a weight off my shoulders. And I have two festivals this weekend, like I said earlier. So I have to work because I know I'm not going to, I'm not going to be working this weekend. I'm going to be having fun. So work hard, play hard. I'm going to get packed up and then see you at dinner and then see you at home but i don't actually know what time i'm gonna get home and i was supposed to have a hair appointment tomorrow but the lady cancelled so that i can do it on friday which is actually better for me because it means that i can stay on campus and get this coursework done it will be submitted it has to be and after that i don't think i have any other deadlines and then i can just focus on revision and prep for class and the class i have tomorrow classes i have tomorrow uh, international trade which I've done the work for and equity finance which I've also done the work for so private acquisitions if I submit my work tomorrow morning early then I can get I'm gonna wake up at five wake up at five and get my coursework done yes that is what we're gonna do but yeah okay I'm gonna pack up now tomorrow's coming I have a feeling <laughs> I have routine again. I feel like the past couple of months have been so like woo -woo. And I'm not gonna lie, I, I still don't feel like I've got into a stable routine since starting the SQD. But I will say I've, I've felt uh, closer to reaching like a destination where it's like I know like my future's good. I think finally the past couple of weeks have felt good, like I've been editing again, I feel like I've been doing work and I've been like working on myself, going going boxing again, which is fun, it's nice. And yeah, like I've been going to lots of concerts and like festivals, I'm slowing down on that shortly, just to focus, but other than that, it feels good. It's like the one that doesn't work for me is just like taking a rest, like no. How do you feel like, what do you see your life on earth coming like in the next I think I, it, I see it becoming, I feel like I see my life becoming, I don't know, you know when like a shooting star is about to like, like it's fizzling, yeah. I feel like it's going to burst, into, but good, 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 like I think it's a good thing, but I just think like right now I'm like in the sprouting part, like I, I like to work today, the work we did, I have not done in like a long time, like I've never, like when I went to BPB library and I sat down and did work, I was like who is she? Like, I actually did it. Even for the SQ, I didn't do that. Yeah. Okay, hopefully, I'll have finished the first part of the SQ. Yeah. Um, and I'll, I think, short term, I want to get into a good routine, get the work done, be productive, wake up earlier, earlier. Um, just like build good habits. And then I think, like, after I've 
hopefully, hopefully, fingers crossed, I've passed it. When you have, when I have, I'll speak, speak into existence, <laughs> when I have passed SMB1, I feel like that will put me in like the same position that you're kind of in, which is like, you feel like you're, you've established the route. I feel like the thing with the SQE is that you don't, like, you always feel up in the air until you've gone past each exactly. stage. and that's what's yeah. going because like, fair enough, okay, I'm past, but I'm actually not, like, I haven't come Exactly. Anything. And it requires a lot of patience because we are kind of going on the timeline of, of other people, <laughs> like, that, that, the timeline that people have set for us, we're not setting any of the timelines ourselves. Like, I feel like with uni, you know it's years, exactly. so you kind of, like, you anticipate that, that yeah. and you kind of know what you're going to do in that three years, but we put, like, there's a timeline given to us and you can't you can't fail anything because then you're like you're not in this process anymore so you feel like you're kind of just like stuck to what somebody else has done like chosen for you and it's not yeah. it's not a nice feeling i will say <laughs> you do feel a bit tied down but at the same time i feel like we're not necessarily tied down That's yet what I love. yeah we're That's like we're like half tied down, half but yeah. I like I still get time to be me before I am actually. Yeah, down. I agree. I agree. I feel like it gives us enough time to kind of be a bit flexible, but within limits. Yeah. So yeah, and I feel like us moving from uni straight to um, the SQE was a bit <laughs> of a game changer. Literally, you say that he's it, crazy it, really it requires something like you know when at, um, before movies where they tell you like oh what's it called disclaimer. I feel like this calls needed not all oh, like oh it impacts you a lot it needed a major disclaimer like the sig the side effects like the side effects to this cause mm -mm. The, burnout, the burnout hits really badly and i think it's because you just feel like you're just uh, the best way i describe it is that in a stream and then the river just starts going crazy and you just have to ride the wave like that's how it feels yeah like you could submerge and the thing is like okay you're riding a wave but sometimes your head is actually under the water that's a good point like you feel like you're drowning like you're still going with it but you're under that water and then sometimes you submerge again and then whoosh exactly that's literally how it's because it kind of just hits you out of nowhere but the good thing is you're with people who are in the same process so yeah. they kind of get it, you're not alone. Yeah, that's what I do love. Well, like, cut through it because obviously, like in my situation, you can just like everyone just moves on. Like, but no, people just move what? on. I thoroughly enjoy, like, when my class was speaking about September, I was. Hey guys, I'm finally back home now. It's 12, 7 past 12. Yes, I know. I actually didn't get home at 7 past 12. I got home around 11.20. It doesn't make it any better, but I do have a 9 a.m. tomorrow, like I said earlier. And uh, I do feel really tired. I feel really tired, but the point is, like, I'm not gonna lie, this part has definitely been the most, like, not unstructured, but unstructured, like, academic part two. I don't feel like I can specifically have a proper set schedule because, like, if there are deadlines that you just have to get them done, there's no way, like, okay, if it takes you a certain amount of time, if it takes you eight hours, it takes you eight hours. Like, it's not like you can say, okay, I'm only gonna work on this for two hours and that's it. If it takes eight hours, it takes eight hours. And in this case, I have time to submit it. That's a thing. And it's less about the coursework, but more so that I have other classes going on at the same time I have coursework. So I also need to do the work for those classes in time 
time for that class and then make sure that my coursework is done i'm also making sure that like i just don't burn myself out it's only week one but i don't think i don't think that's possible anymore literally i don't think it's possible but i'm gonna put everything on charge and head to bed so i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video really enjoyed vlogging today and this was the first day of my mask i'm at least happy that i've been able to vlog if it's not the whole week then just the beginning of at least every new part of this thing but this is actually like the final bit so thank, thank the lord um yes yeah, so gonna go to bed i hope you guys enjoyed watching and make sure to like comment share and subscribe and for now it's been your girl bro if you have any video requests make sure to comment them down below and i will see you next week with another video bye go 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 shorty it's your birthday we going